good morning and welcome back everybody welcome to our channel welcome to another grocery haul i feel like i haven't done one in a while but it probably wasn't that long ago i feel like i did a whole bunch of them at once and then nothing and now we're back so this is gonna be hopefully i wanted to go get like a stock up kind of haul um but then i decided while I was there to just get whatever. Like I didn't have anything in mind. Besides, I had to get milk and lemon juice. Those were the only two things I absolutely 100% needed. Everything else was stock up stuff or fresh fruit and veggies. So we are leaving for Florida in two weeks and I'm hoping that all this will last, but also be enough for when we get home. Obviously not the fresh stuff. Um, that way I don't have to go to the store the moment we get home, but we'll see. So um, let me go ahead and share with you what we got. This is for our full-time eating at home, eating all meals at home, a family of six, sometimes seven, eight, nine, depending on who's here, but all day, every day, six people, all meals from home. My husband does work, but we send him with breakfast, lunch, snacks, all of that. So he eats, even when he's gone, he'll eat food from home. So we go through lots of food here. So we'd love to have you stick around and become part of our family. I share daily videos on how we use up all this food and all of the wonderful homeschool things and everything else we do. So don't forget to subscribe because we'd love to have you. Let me share with you what we got. Okay, so this is quite a haul. We took our time and went through the aisles looking for things, specifically gluten-free things, which is why I really wanted to take my time walking around. So we found some cool stuff, but also I found these rugs. So these were on sale. I think they were $4.99, $4.99, $7.99. I'm not sure, but uh, we needed a new bath mat. So. I believe this was $4.99. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. So I got that for the bathroom. And then this was really, really cute. They had all their fall ones out. So I got this and it is reversible. This is the other side, um, but I really liked this one. So I got this. I used to have these all over our kitchen. The cats tore them up. They use them as like scratching posts. So although I'd like to have more than one, I only got one as a test run to see if they'll even last. So if the cats don't bother them, I'd like to go back and get another one for in front of the stove and for one in front of the washer and dryer. Um, but we'll see what happens with the cats. <laughs> and then let's see, I'll just start down here and then work my way up. We got another Ms. Trax. Okay, this, I have said this over and over. I don't like ice cream. Don't ever offer it to me. I won't eat it, but I will tear this up. I don't know what it is about it. I absolutely love this ice cream. So we grabbed one of those. We're going to have these for lunch today, but also I got some for the freezer. So I just got two original, two thin crusts. Um, I figured we're, it's lunchtime now. And like we got a late start going to Aldi. Usually we like to go to Aldi and be able to come home before lunch, but it's already lunchtime. So I figure we'll use these for lunch. And I also need to pull out some gluten-free stuff out of the freezer. That'll be lunch. The rest will go in the freezers. Um, two things of tortillas. I don't really know that I need them, but I only grabbed two while we we're there just in case I do need them at some point. My kids love these, this hard salami. So we grabbed two bags of that. One for now, one for the freezer. This gluten-free bread is my kids' absolute favorite. They cannot tell the difference between this and regular bread. So I went ahead and grabbed four because they had tons of it today. Normally they don't have much. So I'm lucky to grab one or two. Today they had multiple boxes. So we went ahead and grabbed four. We'll throw them all in the freezer because we have a, I think we have like one or two of them downstairs now, but um, they're all going to go right into the freezer. I just throw it in there like that, pull it out when needed. There's never any issue. The kids wanted bagels, so we grabbed bagels. I've been wanting to make our bagels again. I just haven't gotten around to it and haven't had the time. So we went ahead and grabbed these until I do start making them again. We went ahead and grabbed more mozzarella cheese because we go through quite a bit when we have pizzas and we've been having pizza quite a bit lately. So um, this is my kid's favorite mozzarella. So we grabbed four of those. Um, sub rolls because I got Philly cheesesteak stuff. So finally, I think we're gonna have those tomorrow for dinner. The kids, my husband, everybody, it's their favorite dinner ever. They've been wanting some, so we went ahead and grabbed them today. I'm glad I remember, I actually forgot. We go through the bread section first, didn't even think about it, but we got to the freezer section, saw those, and then we got in line and I ran and grabbed these for them specifically. So, um, Layla's over there, she's gonna show you that stuff, but we'll start over here first. We got bananas and carrots. Layla wanted some more of these. These are totally things, that, like everything in them she can have. So we got chocolate and vanilla. Yay, 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 yeah. I found this today, some brown rice and quinoa fusilli, gluten-free. So we got two boxes of that. I got four boxes of these because 
They're four ounces. When you open the bag, the bag is very tiny and then only, you know, half the bag is full. So when these are open and everyone's eating on them, they're gone immediately, but we grabbed four boxes of those. The kids got some cereal. So we got chocolate puffs. This is for Layla. She wanted the, the rice cereal. This is for my husband. He asked for this. And then the girls picked this one out. So that's some cereal. We got two bags of tortilla chips. Ashlyn picked these out and ate them on the way home. So these are sweet and salty kettle corn popcorners. They were good. I, don't, I tried them in the car. They're okay. I, they're good, but they're also weird to me. I don't know. Like the mixture is weird. I, I can't. I don't know. We got some classic Caesar croutons. We got some more granola for Miss Layla. She has to have gluten-free granola, so she picked out this one. There's a raisin and cinnamon one, I think. I showed them both, told her what was in them. She picked out the cranberry cashew. Yeah, I want yeah. these were on sale today. These were $3.99 instead of $4.50 something. So we got two boxes, wild berry and strawberry. I've never gotten these before. I got two of each flavor, but they're these. Just original and then garlic and herb. Um, so let me know if these are good. We really like the long grain wild rice mix of, what is it called? Ice cream. I don't, rice aroni, I think maybe. So I'm hoping that this is similar, but I don't know. I've never gotten these from Aldi before. I've never done this, so let me know. Um, but we really enjoy the other kind, so hopefully these are good. Um, I've never seen these before and I've never had them before. So if you have, let me know if these are good, but we got these because look at this. I actually picked up the Tennessee one first, smoky and sweet. And then I saw this one, the Georgia sweet heat. So I grabbed them both. Hopefully they're delicious. They sound really good. Um, we're going to have barbecue on Sunday. So I thought we'd pull these out and see, I don't know. I'm going to have to open them and taste them and see what's going on, but they both sound absolutely delicious. We got some chickpea spaghetti. I grabbed two boxes of that as well, just because I was there, saw it, figured not going to hurt to have it because we'll use it. I grabbed more of the sweet and sour sauce because I used this in, what did I make? Sweet and sour meatballs or something the other week. And it was good, but I went ahead and grabbed two of them because I felt like one kind of wasn't enough for us. So I grabbed two for that. And then I grabbed this bang bang sauce. I only grabbed one because normally if we eat something like this, not everyone's going to eat it. So one should be enough. I also grabbed this. Um, I've never had this, so let me know if you've had this too and if it's good. I It was kind of like a spur of the moment thing. I saw it and I was like, hmm, let's try it, but I don't know if I'll ever buy it again or what. I don't know. I was just in a mood today, I guess. I went hungry. That's what it is. I didn't have anything to eat at all. Not one single thing before I went to Aldi this morning. So I came back with all of the stuff. We got two boxes of taco shells, two boxes of Philly cheesesteak meat. This is our favorite, the Aldi one. Absolute favorite. We've tried a million of them. This is the best one, we think. And all it is is beef. There's nothing else in there, so it's wonderful. I also saw these. See, I told you I went hungry. Coconut breaded shrimp. I love these, saw them, and I was like, hmm. It's only like $2.99, I think, two something. So I went ahead and grabbed the box. Then we got one bag of onion rings. Two bags of tater tots, two bags of fries, two boxes of egg rolls, which we're going to have with dinner tonight. Also saw these pot stickers, so we'll also have this with dinner tonight. Miss Layla wanted these crunchy rice rollers, so we got some of those. I grabbed some mild cheddar and some pepper jack cheese. I haven't gotten cheese in a while, so I figured while I was there I was going to go ahead and grab some. Celery because we're out. Got some green peppers, cucumbers, peaches, grapes. Strawberries, we got six strawberries. These were a dollar forty-five, maybe. The grapes were really, really cheap. These were all like their um, stuff on sale this week. The peaches were on sale, the cucumbers were on sale. And then we also found these, and these are gluten-free. So I grabbed four of these. So I might actually use these for our dinner tonight because I am making a what am I making? A chicken lo mein. So I might use these or I might just use gluten-free spaghetti noodles, something I haven't decided, but I don't know. I thought these were gluten. Well, I found these, they were gluten-free. I thought it would just make a really good something. So I don't know if you have recipes given to me. So I bought four of these because they're gluten-free. So hopefully we'll enjoy them. Never gotten them before. Got a watermelon. We got some more of the Southwest guacamole. We love, love, love this. It is so good. They also have a pineapple one. I thought about get, getting that one too, but I just went ahead and grabbed this one. More cream cheese. We got strawberry and regular. Ashton wants me to make more stuffed French toast. 
with the strawberry and then got this. I got two, you flipped it over? Thank you. You can take this one in the bathroom for me if you'd like. Thank you. I got two more of the Irish butter. We got some garden salad mix. I got romaine hearts, which is why I also got the classic Caesar croutons and I picked up some Caesar dressings. That way we can just make our own Caesar salads here. So I had actually got the Caesar salad bag and then I ended up seeing these and I was like, you know what? I'll just buy this stuff and make our own. So that's what that's for, except I didn't even get Parmesan cheese. I just thought of that. Oh well, I'll have, I have to figure that out. These were on sale, $3.99. So we grabbed six of those. They had a ton. Um, we're almost out of our ground beef that we get from our cow. And then, yep, that one goes in the kitchen. Thank you. Um, we aren't getting our other half of a cow until the end of December, I think. So we are running out of ground beef. So I went ahead and grabbed six packs of these. We got some milk for 2% to whole, just because that's what they had. We got a bag of apples, but the kids were eating them in the car as well. We got some mini peppers because it's been a while since I got those. Now here's like some stock up section. Um, I got four of these organic tomato and basil pasta salad, pasta sauce, not salad. I grabbed five organic ketchups, two mayonnaise, two of the Caesar salads. These were also marked down. These were only a dollar something. So I grabbed three of these. These are my absolute favorite dressings in the world. Ashland too. We've been eating salad almost daily. We've been going through them, flying through them, but also they're great to marinate things in. And then you can make a really, like a whole bunch of meals out of them. So I grabbed three of those. Um, some organic apple juice. I'm out of lim lemon juice. I've been canning, I'm out. So we grabbed two bottles of these. I grabbed two things of French vanilla creamer for my husband, and I think that's it. Did I show you everything? Sometimes I feel like I forget stuff, but all of this stuff, all of it. So like I said, all the fresh stuff will end up going through. The other things hopefully will last until we get back and I won't have to run to the store. Um, you know, it's when you drive for, it's a 14 hour trip. That does not include stops from us where we live all the way to Florida where we're going. Um, and the last thing we're gonna wanna do when we get home after a two and a half week vacation is go to the grocery store. So hopefully I can find something out of all of this stuff for, you know, a day or two and then go to the store, but we'll have to see what happens. And Simba wanted to say hi. That is it. Now I need to get all of this put away and then make my kiddos some lunch because it's lunchtime. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for hanging out with me while I shared with you our groceries. Grocery hauls are my favorite videos ever to watch. I don't know why. I love to see what other people get. So if you like grocery hauls, give me a thumbs up, stick around, become part of our family, and we'll talk to you down in the comments and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.